Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Learn with Sumi. In this video, we'll be solving or we will learn how to find the angle between radius vector and the tangent for the curve r is equals to a into 1 plus sine theta as indicated where theta is equals to pi by 2. Okay, so we'll be solving this. Similar problems I have solved in the previous videos as well. You can go through that uh, and uh, if you have any doubts, you can just put it in the comment section. And do not forget to uh, like, share and subscribe to my channel. Okay, if you want more and more videos uh, as such, you can simply uh, put it in the comment section and also share it with your friends. So let's get started with this one. Here, you know how we do this. First, we will be like, we'll, uh, let's, let's just write the question. Okay, so here. We will apply log on both sides. So we will take log on both sides. Correct? So once we take the log on both sides, it becomes like log r is equals to log a into 1 plus sine theta. Now, I have discussed this uh, formula in the previous videos also. Log A into B becomes log A plus log B. Isn't it? Log A into B is nothing but log A plus log B. So here you can consider this as log A and this, this, this term as log B. So I will write this as this this as it is the expansion of this as log a plus log 1 plus sine theta now the expansion is done as the expansion is done we can now differentiate this with respect to theta the first step is you have to take the log on both sides expand it then differentiate with rest. second step is going to be like differentiate this is r okay differentiate with respect to theta so if you differentiate this with respect to theta it becomes what log r becomes 1 by r differentiation of log r is 1 by r and when you differentiate r with respect to theta it becomes t dr by d theta is equals to log of a differentiation of log of a it is a constant so it becomes 0 differentiation of a constant is 0 plus log of 1 plus sine theta so the differentiation of this becomes 1 divided by 1 plus sine theta correct now I have differentiated log of 1 plus sine theta now I have to differentiate 1 plus sine theta so differentiation of 1 plus sine theta I can write it as 1 1 is a constant so 0 plus this plus so differentiation of sine theta is cos theta correct this is done now we know that 1 by r into dr by d theta is nothing but cot phi, right? So, cos theta, this becomes cos theta divided by 1 plus sine theta. Now, theta value is given in the question itself. The value of theta is given. Here is a question at theta is equals to pi by 2. So we have like two ways of solving this question. One is a traditional way. We can uh, write the cos theta and uh, cos theta uh, formula, 1 formula and sin theta formula in the trigonometric uh, for, uh, formula. From the trigonometric formula. But that will become a long procedure. So if uh, directly we can substitute a theta value here that is pi by 2. Otherwise we can go, uh, we can do it as we did in the previous videos. So, uh, I will do first a shortcut method that is directly applying the pi by 2 value. So, if you like this method, you can follow You can follow this method only. But if you do not like this method, uh, I will show you the next, uh, uh, the long way to do it. That also you can do, uh, that also you can follow and do it. That is also not a wrong method. So, first what I will do is pi by th theta is nothing but here from the question only theta is where? theta is equals to pi by 2. We know this, right? Where theta is equals to pi by 2. So first, I will simply write it as theta is equals to pi by 2. I will write down those values and I will simplify it. So cot phi is nothing but 
theta uh, sorry cos pi by 2 divided by 1 plus sin pi by 2. What is cos pi by 2? Cos pi by 2 is 0. And 1 plus sin pi by 2 is what? Sin pi by 2 is 1. Correct? So it becomes 0 by 2. And 0 by anything is what? 0 itself. So cot phi is equals to 0. Now I just want the value of phi. Right? I just want the value of phi. So what I'll do? Phi is equals to cot inverse of phi. Sorry, cot inverse of 0. Phi is equals to cot inverse of 0. So, phi becomes cot inverse of 0 is nothing but pi by 2 which is also 90 degrees. Okay, I got the phi value. This is which way? This is which way of doing? This is directly applying theta, uh, theta value in, in place of theta. Now, I got the phi value here. And after this, we have to find what? In this question, I also forgot to mention we, are, uh, we have to find the slope also, right? Also, find slope of tangent, correct? Of tangent as indicated at this, like at the rate of uh, pi by 2. Theta is equals to pi by 2. So, we also have to find the slope. So, we know what uh, tan psi is slope. So, tan psi can be like uh, angle psi we can find it by adding uh, the uh, phi and uh, uh, theta that is the sum of exterior angle is nothing but equal to uh, the sum of uh, opposite interior angles. Correct? But before finding the slope we will also do it in our traditional way. Traditional way in the sense we did in the previous like we did this in the previous. So, after this. Uh, after this, we used to expand this or write it a uh, trigonometric formulae for this and then reduce it and then write it in terms of cot or tan then uh, find the value of phi. So, we will do it in that way. Here, we have just substituted theta value as pi by 2 and found that uh, phi is equal to nothing but 90 degrees. But we also do it in the uh, ways which uh, using which we have solved the previous questions. So, here I will rewrite this cot phi is nothing but cos theta divided by 1 plus sin theta. Correct? So here what I will do is cos theta. I can write cos theta. I will write it here so that you will understand easily. Cos theta I can write it as cos square theta by 2, okay, minus sine square theta by 2, okay, clear? So, cos theta, I can write it like this. And here, 1 plus sine theta, I have. So, 1, I can write it as, you already know maybe cos uh, theta by 2 plus sine square theta by 2 is equals to 1. Cos square theta by 2 plus sin square theta by 2 is equals to 1. And this sin theta, this sin theta, I can write it as 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2. Correct? Now I have written all these trigonometric formulas that can be used in this uh, equation. Okay? Here cos theta I can write it as, I will start writing from here, cot pi equals to cos theta. I can write it as cos square theta by 2, correct, minus sin square theta by 2, whole divided by, 1 I can write it as cos square theta by 2 plus sin square theta by 2. And sin theta, this plus this one is nothing but this entire thing. Plus, instead of sine theta, I can write it as 2 sine theta by 2 cos theta by 2. Done. Now, if you see this, this looks like 
a square minus b square equals to a plus b into a minus b if you remember this formula correct so i will write this as cot phi equals to cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2 into cos theta by 2 minus sin theta by 2. Correct? The expansion is done. Whole divided by. Whole divided by. If you can see this, this looks like a square plus b square plus 2ab. Correct? 2ab. Which is nothing but a plus b the whole square. Correct? So, can I write this as a is this and b is this. So, cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2 the whole square. So, this one and this one will get cancelled. Now, what am I left with? Cot phi. If you do not understand this, I will expand it and understand. Okay, so this is cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2. Okay, let me write in the square bracket so that it will be, it will be easy to understand. Cos theta by 2 minus sin theta by 2. Okay, done. Whole divided by. I will, this is a square, right? So, we will expand this. Cos theta by 2. Plus sin theta by 2. Okay. Into cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2. So cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2. Cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2. This 2 will get cancelled. Now what am I left with? Cos theta by 2 this one minus sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2 then this I can further write it as this I can further write it as what I can take cos theta by 2 common and 1 minus tan theta by 2 whole divided by cos theta by 2 to 1 plus tan theta by 2. If this is becoming complicated to you, I am just dividing this by the whole equation by cos theta by 2. Okay. I am just dividing this by cos theta by 2. If you want, I will write that step itself. You can ignore this step. You can ignore this step. I will write it in that term. Cos theta by 2. Cos theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2. Okay. Minus sin theta by, sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2. Numerator I have divided, denominator I will divide. Okay. Here I have cos theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2 plus sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2. Correct. Cos theta by 2 will get cancelled. Cos theta by 2, cos theta by 2, cos theta by 2 will get cancelled. So, cot phi, what am I left with? This is 1, this is 1. So, 1 minus sin by cos is tan, tan theta by 2 divided by, uh, this is 1 plus sin by cos is what? Tan, tan theta by 2. Clear? So this much you understood. So here 1 minus tan theta by 2 and 1 plus cot theta by 2, this is nothing but cot pi by 4 plus 
theta is equal to 1 minus tan theta divided by 1 plus tan theta. Okay. Got 45 pi by 4 plus theta is 1 minus tan theta divided by 1 plus tan theta. So, can I write this in terms of cot? So, cot pi is equals to cot pi by 4. What is theta here? Pi by 2. So, plus pi. Sorry. So, uh, so this, this theta is theta by 2. Correct? So, cot pi is equals to nothing but pi by 4 plus theta by 2. And in this question, we know that theta, theta is equals to pi by 2. Correct? So, we will substitute the theta value. So, cot phi equals to cot pi by 4 plus theta is pi by 2 whole divided by 2. So, this is going to be cot pi by 4 plus theta by 2 is I can write it as pi by 4 only. So, this is going to become cot 2 pi by 4 which is equals to cot pi by 2. So, cot phi is equals to cot pi by 2. So, phi is nothing but pi by 2. Okay. So, this you can see this is so long method to find but yeah uh, this is the method you have you have, you have been following since you you have you have been solving your previous questions correct so and this is the short method using which you can directly substitute the theta theta value and you can find it out as phi is equals to pi by 2 here also here also you got the same value phi is equals to pi by 2 which is 90 degrees now what we have to do is we know find the slope right what is slope tan psi right tan psi is the slope correct theta uh, phi is pi by 2 tan psi is the slope so psi how we can find psi is nothing but phi plus theta so psi is equals to uh, phi value is pi by 2 and theta is also pi by 2 correct so i can write this as pi by 2 uh, by pi by 2 this is nothing but pi so slope is yeah so this is our psi so tan psi is nothing but tan pi so what is the value of tan pi okay let me check what is the value of tan pi tan pi is nothing but zero hence i can write it as the slope the slope of the tangent is zero. Done. This is all. Thank you for watching.